big hand slap, and uh, it's a knockout punch by Hakuho. In sumo, once a bout is over, the victorious wrestler slices his hand through the air in a ceremonial gesture. The first movement is... Once the referee has called out his name, the winner extends his hand and slices it downward and to the right. Here's a wrestler responding to having his name called. It's said the hand motions mimic a sword's cutting strokes. After winning a match that awards prize money, the wrestler will follow with an additional set of strokes. Before receiving prize money, the hand is moved to the left, the right, and then the center. It's a show of appreciation to the three different deities of victory. The rewarding of prize money became part of the sumo tournament system in 1955. At the time, a standard hand gesture had not yet been decided upon, so each wrestler made up his own. Then in 1966, former Yokozuna Futabayama was chairman of the Japan Sumo Association. He pushed for the adoption of a standardized hand gesture, as he felt that it would show more decorum. From that point on, the now familiar hand gesture became part of the sumo tradition.